Today's video is seriously exciting for all Steam gamers. If you've built up a massive collection of Steam games, you already know the struggle you can't carry your PC or laptop everywhere, which means your favorite titles are stuck at home. But what if I told you there's a powerful tool that lets you play Steam games on almost any Android device like Magic? We've already tested several tools, including native Steam emulators like Pubia and Game Native. While these apps have generated plenty of buzz, they're still in the early stages of development, often struggling with unstable performance and limited compatibility with popular games. That's where GameHub shines. Unlike those native emulators, GameHub lets you download and run Steam games smoothly on your Android device. It's powerful, stable, and built with a premium, user-friendly interface that anyone can use. In this video, I'll walk you through how to install the GameHub emulator, add your Steam games, and tweak the best settings for top-tier performance. Now, let's get started with the installation. First, download the latest version of the GameHub emulator. Head over to the official GameHub website and download the APK file. Don't worry, it's 100% free and officially powered by games, so you're in safe hands. Once downloaded, install the APK just like any other app. After that, launch GameHub. The app will prompt you to log in, and you've got options. Use your email, Google account, or Apple ID. I recommend signing in with your Google account. It's the fastest and easiest way to get started. Next, you'll be asked to pick an emoji for your profile. Just tap the circle, choose your favorite emoji, and you're good to go. Then, set a display name or nickname so other GameHub users can find you and hit continue. And now, welcome to the new GameHub interface. Simply go to the upper left part of the screen and press the icon that says My. This will take you to a panel. Here, find the section that says Steam and click on the button that says Log in to Steam. It will take you to the Steam login page, where you will need to enter your username and password. Once you enter this information, click the login button. You will then be asked for a confirmation code, which will be sent to your email address. When you get the code, enter it exactly as shown on the screen, and your session will start automatically. Here you will have all your account information. All the games that you own or purchases are available on your Steam account will appear in the GameHub game library. All these games can be installed directly on your mobile device so you can play them. If you're completely new and don't have have any games yet but are looking for free ones, you'll first need to install the Steam app from the Google Play Store. Once downloaded, open the app and log in using your Steam ID and password. Then search for free games or use the filter option to set the price to free. This section will show all the official free games offered by Steam. Simply find a game you like, click on it, scroll down, and tap the Add to Library button. Now go back to Game Hub and search for the game you added earlier, or open the Steam section where games you haven't downloaded yet will appear in black and white. Find the game, select it, and press the Get the Game button. Before downloading the game, you must check the required storage and your available storage. The download will then start automatically on your mobile device. Once the game is downloaded, click on Play Game and you'll see a window where some necessary files will be downloaded to run the game on your Android device. When all the files finish downloading, simply press the Play button to start the game on your Android device. This game needs a Steam login, and unfortunately, it's not connecting. So we'll try another game called Little Nightmares 2 Demo. Oops, game crashed. It's time to optimize the settings because the default configuration isn't tuned for performance. Tap the three dots next to your game and open PC Game Settings. Under the General Settings tab, you'll find the option to adjust the resolution. I recommend setting the resolution to 720p for a balance between visuals and performance. For DirectX HUD set as simple. For the compatibility layer, select Proton 10. For translation parameters, if your device is high-end, select performance or fast mode. For mid-range, choose normal or safe and fast. Here you'll also find the latest GPU drivers supported by Snapdragon devices. For DXVK, download DXVK V2.6-1. For VKD 3D, go with VKD 3D Proton. For the translator, use Box 64 version 0.35. Exactly like this, you have a Steam game running on your mobile device, just as you see on the screen. It's important to mention that whether the game runs smoothly depends on how heavy the game is and the specifications of your Android device. RAM and available storage space also play a big role. As you can see, the game is starting, and at the bottom, there is a small window showing all the resources the game is currently using. And that's everything for today. If you want a detailed walkthrough on how to tweak the settings in GameHub for the best performance, just drop a comment below, I'd love to help. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to like and subscribe for more awesome gaming tutorials. See you next time.